Sí, no rock. So, I think a lot of people have a sense of admiration, or at the very least, a sense of appreciation for a more simple life. Living amongst nature seems like a lifestyle that's more peaceful, more calm, and sort of feels like the way humans were meant to live. That's right. To some degree. And so, Ivana and I have been falling in love with a YouTube channel <laughs> where they've got really good videos. One specifically, it starts off with all the images of the city and it's got the music, very fast paced, and it sort of seems to be depicting the rat race or the hustle and bustle. And then the screen goes static. <laughs> and you see this very impressive Romanian man Hello. building his home in the countryside. <laughs> so today we are very excited to spend the day with Alex. He's got a house in the countryside that is more like a palace. Not only building a place to live, but building a place to thrive with farming and the goal is to be fully sustainable. So join us everybody as we go hang out with Alex. We are back in Romania. So excited. So excited for this. <laughs> Let's go. <laughs> All right, introducing Alex's hidden paradise here in the Romanian countryside. Now to be clear, this is where he lives, but he's got a whole bunch of projects on the go and many uh, Airbnb units for rental. So he's got seven hectares and he's been here seven years. I said to him, in 10 more years, 10 more hectares? He said, I hope so. <laughs> and so this is really something special. I think this is what a lot of people dream of, but the minute you start to make a plan about how to build a house, out of recycled material, you realize it's just too difficult. <laughs> but Alex did it, man. Yeah. What a place to live. Love the artwork. The chickens there, we stay on the eggs and make babies. <laughs> oh, chickens over here making babies. This is greenhouse for tomatoes. Yes, tomatoes, yeah, and um, other small plants who need some protection. Ah, uh, okay, okay. Ah. Tomato sauce? Yes. In the, in the, in the, and we make fire because it's much easier. Make Not fire. Than, uh, this is like a steel drum that you turned into a, a stove. Yes, yes. But it's work like uh, efficient because it's come the fire like this, and because it's the barrel in the top, they turn around the smoke and they go ah. down and it's come here. Okay. And because it's this uh, reaction. So the exhaust is actually from the bottom. Yes. And then the exhaust goes up and maybe heats the room above us. Yes. Which is ah. bedroom. Yes, my bedroom. Wow, your bedroom. Yes. <laughs> Heated bedroom. Heated bedroom. So I don't even know what to talk about first because everything is amazing here. This is like the ultimate clubhouse or treehouse yeah. or like a, you know. Earth house. Earth house. Everything comes from the earth. Everything comes from the earth. Uh, oh, what a place to be. What a place to be. Wow. <laughs> All right, let's settle in and then we'll see uh, what we can show the people at home. Something special. <laughs> Very nice. Uh, welcome drink. Obligatory Romanian welcome drink. Norok. Homemade and very good. Oh, smooth as butter. It's no? strong. <laughs> oh my good. goodness. Very good. Sasha, Sasha, Sasha. Ready? Sasha, ready? Sasha, one of the Good most beautiful girl. dogs I've ever seen? Hi, I think baby. so. I think so. Hey, baby. <laughs> Don't eat my GoPro. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, go. All right. Look at this fruit. It's full of antioxidant. I forgot the name. I'll write it down below. And we're just picking it out. So Alex's mom can make jams out of it. This is full of antioxidant and uh, this fruit is just picked out from the garden right here it's so cool let me just taste it actually it looks like mini blueberries but it's not blueberries it tastes like wine like a little bit like grape mm. juice it tastes like a wine mm -hmm. tastes like a wine. mixture of grapes and wine and blueberries sounds good 
It is. <laughs> it's actually good. But it's not too sweet. But uh, I would imagine when uh, it's made into, a, into jams, it will be really, really delicious with bread. So good. <laughs> All right. Ivana has finished preparing those berries. And so now we are going to forage for some mushrooms. The idea is to make chorba. today we can make chorba and jam. So let's go uh, hunt in the forest here. And as you guys probably remember from our previous video of foraging for mushrooms, it's very good to be with Alex because a lot of the mushrooms are going to kill you. So you really got to be with someone who knows what they're doing. And Ivana and I certainly do not. <laughs> so let's go. Okay, so we've got the book here. Yes. But you're still telling me this mushroom is a little bit magical. A little bit, yes. It's Magic poisonous. Mushroom. Poisonous. It's poisonous, yes. But if you prepare it correctly, hallucinogenic. Magic. I don't re recommend. I don't recommend. <laughs> no. Yeah, me neither. You so see? what we'll do is we'll take it with us just so nobody else gets, gets poisoned by it. Yes. <laughs> Ready? Woo! <laughs> Good job, baby. Oh, ho, ho. that's not a mushroom. That's an umbrella, dude. Look at this thing. Look at this. <laughs> that's a big <laughs> mushroom. Whoa. That's, a, that's half double mushroom. Double. <gasps> double rainbow. <laughs> Wild apples, look at this. So many. Hold on. Is apple? Yeah. Wild ones. Alex. Can eat it? Can eat? Yes. Yes? Can eat. So many. It's so cute. My guess is it's gonna be so tasty and sour. 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 <laughs> the yellow one. The yellow one is more sweet. Yellow one oh, is more sweet. Oh yellow down. This one. This one, if you want to try. Oh, try this one, okay. Yellow one. Wild apple, taste test. Redemption. Better. better. Redemption. <laughs> Good. Good. Wow. Red ones. <laughs> Strawberry mushroom. Strawberry mushroom. <laughs> Jackpot. Jackpot. I got six good ones. Ah, oh, they're all wet. Soggy, no good, right? No, it's not good enough. How about that big one? Over there, see? Oh my gosh, jackpot. Right here. See? You missed it, you passed by it. Oh, this one's soggy too. Right There's a big one and you missed it. <sighs> I think I'm the worst mushroom picker. How about this one? Yeah. There you go. Your one is better than me, I admit it. <laughs> Ivana is a jungle lady. <laughs> She's got the... Uh, oh, That's enough for dinner, no? Oh, very nice. So many here. This is better than going to the supermarket. True fact. <laughs> Look at True this. fact. Mother wow. Nature's supermarket. Oh, what a day. <laughs> Sasha. Sasha, go. <laughs> Happiness is drinking palinka in the morning, playing with the dog, and fetching mushrooms. Yeah. Let me tell you, <laughs> happiness is very simple. <laughs> Ivana, yeah. you think Romania is a good country for travel, or you think it's kind of boring, not much to do? What do you think? Be honest. My favorite. <laughs> <laughs> Love it. Wow. <laughs> look at Yo, the chickens. These chickens look like they're wearing a toupee, no? <laughs> look like she's wearing a wig. 
Right. Right? Looks like he's going bald and he's ashamed of himself, so he puts some <laughs> fake hair on his head. Doesn't look like it. <laughs> Looks like he's wearing a wig. <laughs> this is what. <laughs> All right. <laughs> Let's go back. Time to make some curba, baby. <laughs> All right. Foraging for mushrooms completed. This is five kilos? Yes. Wow. Today we got five kilos. Five kilos. And this is uh, Alex's harvest from yesterday. <laughs> <laughs> Which almost, almost looks like more. Yeah, that's true. <sighs> wow. And this is the remains. Yeah, and uh, Alex won't throw this out. He will put it back in the soil and everything will just grow again. Nope. So Very sustainable. The ultimate goal here is to be 100% non-reliant on any right supermarket or anything nature baby grow the veggies got the chickens <laughs> got the ducks yeah next year he's gonna get two goats yeah and the idea is everything will be 100 percent self-dependent that's right uh amazing okay can't wait for mushroom chorba <laughs> you know what your hat looks a bit like a mushroom yes <laughs> <laughs> I'm from here. <laughs> I'm from here. <laughs> All right, interview with the man himself. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Five questions, okay? Yes. First question. Yes. Favorite song? Petris Pirescu. Uh -huh. Okay. Romanian song. Yeah, Romanian song. Okay, yes. I put the name in the description, in the, in the title. Okay. Uh, in the description. Yes. Okay, uh, number two. More importantly, how did you think of doing this? How did you think of doing this? Like, how did you start? Were you born? Uh, I, were you born on a farm? No, I born in the city. But in the summer, I was going the in the countryside to my grandmother, grandfather, mm. and I bring some ideas from there. I I, I see the countryside, live life, uh. and for that probably. And when I was child in the city, from the city we go in the forest to building like a tree house, uh, like a child, you know, I was a child. Ah. And I have this in my heart, you know. I thought so. This to me looks like the greatest tree house ever. I said that when I came in, like <laughs> yeah. a clubhouse. It's like, yeah. a, it's like. This is like my childhood, you know, it's bring to me, you know. When I think, ah. when I see this and I remember in the childhood, it's the same. Ah. So the same. It's more modern one. Okay, favorite part of this new lifestyle you have? Yes. What's the favorite part? Uh, this one. Yeah. Yes. Okay, so what's the hardest part? The hardest part? Yeah. Uh, hmm, I don't know <laughs> sure if I have some wow. hard parts. Imagine that. Yeah. yeah. So easy to think of your favorite part, but hard to think of the hardest part. Harder so because time. yeah, probably I want more people around me, like uh, mm. you know, like to real, know about this. yeah, real oh. connection, real relationship. Mm. Ah, you okay, know? okay, okay. So it's a uh, kind of secluded, secluded here. Yes. In also, a... I I want to building a family and. Uh, ah. Okay. Right, right. Do you this think... is the probably uh, hard a little. Ah, okay. To find the right person, you know, to. But to your enjoy. your goal will be to raise a family in, in the, the self-sustainable. Yes. Built by your own hands. Many farm. kids, you know. Oh, Ten wow. kids. Oh, that would be nice. <laughs> Many kids. <laughs> yes. <laughs> More than five. <laughs> More than five. <laughs> same. <laughs> Max in ten. <laughs> ah, same. <laughs> same. <laughs> Yeah. Wow. wow, so look good in the mirror. <laughs> yeah. Your passion is this? My passion is more travel, but I want to have 10 kids and travel the world and, yeah, and just true. travel Why and not? have kids. Yes. This is yes. also, also one of Steve's dream actually, to have a farm in Canada. Yeah. In Canada, but it's harder so in Canada. The thing is, something like this is so... <laughs> Even when you start to make a plan, what's the first step? What's the second step? It's so hard. What you've done is such an amazing it's thing. It's not because hard. If you have time, it's easy, you know, mm. because it's something then you like it. You're thinking, you're thinking, and you're thinking, and when you start, it's not so hard. Just do it. Just do it, yeah. Mm. And okay. you find a way for you. You right. find a way to every day. It's some challenge. It's something. It keeps you there, you know. Mm. It's nice. Sounds right. Yes. Everybody right. can do it. Everybody can do it. Everybody. Okay. If you want, if you want, you can do it for sure. So we can all come here to learn about this kind of lifestyle from Alex. Yes. He sets up a good example here. Yes. <laughs> and I share everything with the internet. 
if uh -huh. you have any questions you can write me on comments and i respond you in videos or if you're so Very long nice. away <laughs> i will be here for with internet you know i like right, the internet right. i like technology we can yes we can internet still works here yes i have internet <laughs> we have internet yes. here electricity i'm a technological guy <laughs> I tell you what, thanks God for YouTube because we found you on YouTube. Yes. Because we're on YouTube and here we are. Yes. What do you think? Yeah. Mushroom soup? Mushroom soup. Mushroom soup. <laughs>
It's very yeah, clever. It's very yeah, clever very rocket clever. stove. Yes, yes. Amazing. Uh, this is almost a classroom. Are you planning on having children? Yes. Ten of them. Ten. ten. Maxim ten, mine uh, minimum five. <laughs> Steve. <laughs> I need just a girl. I like this guy. I like this guy. I need just a girl. <laughs> or it's two. like a classroom though. You know, it's like a classroom. Or two. No, 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 no. Say one, say one. Uh, really beautiful place. This is the front area, like a like a foyer, like a living room. Like a living room, yeah. Is it for tea? Yes. This wow. is for tea. Plans. Uh, this is your these are the books you probably showed in your videos where you learned how to build. Yeah, a couple of them, yeah. Couple of them. Again, more tea. Tea, yes, the same. And then the greenhouse. Greenhouse. And my you mom's... got your you got your mom working still. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> my mom she cook a lot of things. She prepare for the winter. She put uh, all the mushroom what we have collect. She makes some delicious things and we put in the jar and uh, we eat in the winter. She's helping you out. Yes. She Although she's out. just visiting from Spain. Yes. She, she goes back visiting. and then you'll be here all winter in this big house by yourself. Yes. Wow. In three years. 80%. 80%. And I have some friends who help me with the big trees. I ah. can bring from the forest and they help me. My mom, she helped me with the pleasure. Okay, okay. And we mix cob a lot of people. But 80% all you. Yes, yeah, my plan, my ideas, my work. It's very impressive. Yes. I like it, thank you. Good. <laughs> wow. Just got a nice gift wow. from Alex. A bottle of Cluj spring water. <laughs> AKA. Palenka. <laughs> now, uh, before Alex comes back, a whole bunch of compliments for him. Some things I noticed. One, he's got a smile mm -hmm. that's so healthy. His teeth are so healthy. His face has no fat in it. There's an incredible sincerity and an incredible uh, vitality right. to this sort of lifestyle where he's living off the grid. He's living off super healthy ingredients, organic ingredients. He looks healthy Beautiful. in his face. Yeah. Also, his hands and forearms are so strong. <laughs> I feel like I got secretary fingers. I feel like I have <laughs> keyboard fingers. He's got huge veins. He's got so strong. There's a capability right. of these people that live in this kind of thing and are able to do this so well. Mm -hmm. uh, really admirable guy. That's true. Good guy to have as our new friend. Mm -hmm. Because uh, he seems to be doing life the way life ought to be done. Yeah, that's true. Which is really nice to be around. Special thanks, big multi mask to Alex. Look at this. I mean, he built this whole house by himself and he's building one or three more. There is one that is used for Airbnb. You can stay here as well. And uh, I mean, thank you, Alex. The star of the show. Yeah. <laughs> multi mask to him and multi mim to him and his mother. Um, multi mim is multi mim. Plural thanks. Yes. Good job. <laughs> Who's more Romanian now? <laughs> Very Thanks for nice. watching, everybody. Bye. Goodbye gift. <laughs> tomato shot. Hot. Oh. Hot tomato yes. liquid. Yes. Sounds bad. And let me tell you. Mm. Delicio. So good. <laughs> and you say it's good with palenka. It, it works. Yeah. It works you, with palenka. You, you feel Yeah. Mm. Yeah. It's, good. it's so good. <laughs> good pair. Good pair. Yes. Very nice. Wow. They pair so well together. Palinka and hot tomato juice. Very good. Sounds bad. Let me tell you. Five stars. Let's be clear. Mm. Six stars. Yeah. Six stars so on five. <laughs> Very good. Bonus star. <laughs>